it's usually you're trying to look at what the defense is doing to you and try to match that in terms of that standpoint. But, um, you know, if you had a real hot guy, if all of a sudden we had 12 personnel in the game and, and the tight ends had 18 catches, you know, now you're saying, hey, there's something to that. But um, we don't look at it and say, hey, Nick's in a little bit more of a rhythm because 12's in the game as opposed to 11's in the game. You've had a lot of success running the ball so far. What have you seen from the ground game specifically the back to yeah, well, I think it's both of them. I think it's Starks and Lacey. They're two really big backs, and they're both they're downhill runners, and they're physical, and they're, they're uh, you know, it's going to take a lot of guys to get them down. You know, very, very rarely is one guy getting to the ground. They're running through arm tackles. You know, I think you got to get 11 guys to the ball, but they made a concerted effort even before Aaron got hurt to, to run the ball, and they had been running the ball pretty effectively, you know, before Aaron got hurt. So I think it's, it's a real concern of ours because they're two big backs. They're two physical backs. Uh, you know, it's... it's it's, it's a tough task when you when you have physical guys like that because you may have one unblocked guy at the point of attack, but you may need to have two or three. So, you know, it's about getting 11 guys running to football and gang back. How do you assess Lane Johnson's uh, progress this far? Are you pleased with how he's done? Yeah, I think Lane has really come along. You know, I prob he probably played his best game to date, um, you know, against Oakland. And I, and I think it, it, all rookies, it's it's the experience factor. The, the one thing, and I've said this about Lane before, usually he make, very rarely makes the same mistake twice, and that's a, a mark of a really good football player. But the the issue is you can't show him everything just because of his lack of experience. So, you know, I've seen a steady progress as the season's gone along. Um, you know, I, I think he's got a great group of older guys to learn from, you know, with Todd and Kels and Evan and Jason. Um, they've really kind of taken him under, under their wings and, Kind of fostered that, and, but I, I, the one thing we know is he's a, he's a great athlete, um, and he's a great effort player. That's the one thing that you know. If you, if you want to play here, you got to be a great effort player, and I think Lane understands that. He's always played with great effort, and as he gets through more experiences and sees more diverse looks, he, he's just going to continue to grow. But his best game today was against Oakland. Is that because do you think a light came on from him, or is it just a 